Hello guys, today I'm going to be showing you how to install audio recorder on iOS 11 um, jailbroken with Electra. Right now I have the iPhone 10 on 11.1.2 jailbroken with Electra, and this is just a quick tutorial, it's pretty cool. Um, I do recommend actually buying the license and donating to the developer. Um, I'm going to be showing you how to actually do this without buying the license, uh, but this is just for you to kind of try it out and see if you like it or not. And if you do, then you can go ahead and buy the license from the developer. Um, I don't really support piracy, but in some cases, is um, they don't have a trial, you don't know what you're doing, you don't know what the application is. So um, that's why I'm showing you this, but like I said, I don't support it. Um, if you want to use the application, please, please, please go and buy the license. Um, so, first of all, you have to be jailbroken, you have to be on Wi Fi, and you need to know your IP address. I have the link to this, this, uh, this website on the description, and I'll have the step by step on there as well. So, basically, you copy this code, you get an application called Putty, it's, uh, it's kind of free. So you just SSH to your um, iPhone's IP address, you log in as root, your password, um, it's going to be Alpine by default, but like I said, I'm going to have uh, all that in the description. So once you are here, um, you right click and it paste the code, just press enter and it will go in and download and uh, install this application on your phone. I'll have a video recording on my phone as well, but kind of right now it's kind of pointless because it's going to respring in a minute. Um, in addition to Putty, you're going to need uh, uh, the Win SCP, which is you can SSH and see your files and stuff like that. And also, I'm going to have a link to this audio uh, pre audio preferences on the description as well. So as you can see, it's going and doing its thing. It's doing the UI cache. It can take up to 30 seconds, pretty easy, and then it's going to respring. And at that point, I'll go ahead and show you what it looks like on my phone. Um, so I'm gonna wait a little bit. Make sure if you guys find this video useful, make sure you share, subscribe, and comment if you need to know anything or if you have any questions, if it doesn't work for you or anything like that. Uh, so just for spring, right there. Um, so I'll show you my phone view once it comes up here. I'm going to go ahead and unlock it. Alright, so... As you can see here, if you go to settings, um, and then you go to audio recorder, um, you're not going to get this. You're going to say by um, audio recorder. Like I said, I do suggest doing that. But in this case, we're going to see if um, we want to just try it out and we don't know what we're doing yet. So we're going to go to uh, WinSCP. Uh, same thing, you're going to SSH with the IP address, uh, root, and Alpine. You go to Bootstrap, you go to Library, you go to Preference Bundles. And I've got to kind of refresh that here. And you see Auto Recorder and you drag that file that we downloaded earlier, we're going to replace it. Go down and right click on it, go to profiles, make sure it is 0755. And once we go back, we have to kill settings. We go back. And as you can see here, it's going to change pretty quickly. There we go. So that's it for now. Um, like I said, if you do want to actually use this, uh, make sure you run this code in PuTTY, and then you go back and you do this, and then you actually buy uh, the license. It's only 3.99.
it's not a big of a deal. So, thanks for watching. If you find this video useful, please rate, subscribe, and comment. And uh, I appreciate a share. Thank you so much. Have a good day.